What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I hope you are just excited as I am for this one because today we're going to paint our Jeep Gladiator Rubicon body from Proline. I already trimmed it down as you can see. I will give you a close up in just a minute so you can take a good look. In my taste it's a bit, a bit open but we still got the Dusty Motors cover so we're covered there. Uh -huh. Let me show you up close and then we can start uh, masking it. I've got, my, got a few decals to make myself I can show you. I'm really looking forward to this so let's do this. Okay guys this is it. This is what we gotta work with. It's a nice fit on the bumper here. A bit open for my taste but with the Dusty Motors cover in there, I think we're good. Could have kept it a bit longer. The posts are down both on maximum. So one down for each. Or I need to trim the posts to get it even lower. We can do that. The shocks are not hitting here or here. But I think I'm, I'm okay with this. Very open in the back. and needed to trim it down quite a bit to get the, I didn't want to take the bumper off, so this is how I've trimmed it down for here. Also made some decals myself, I want to get on there. These are, in, these are mirror images because I'm gonna stick them on the inside. I need to, them to be in mirror. Now let us wash this puppy and get her ready for painting. Here we are. Let me start off by saying this is not a how-to video. There are loads of how-to videos on YouTube that do a way better job than I do. I just wanted to show you how I convert my sentiment into something new. I always like to do some body work. So also found some masking tape, real thin masking tape from my airbrush days. Maybe easier to do some curved lines with this. We'll see. It's the first time doing an RC body for me, so. But let's start off with the dark colors. That's, that's what I hear in every uh, video to start off with the darker colors and work your way back. So let us do that and start with the black. Now you have a nice thin line, which makes it a bit easier to, to put the other tape next to. Almost ready guys. Just need to put a logo on here. And spray the black. Okay. <clears throat> All right, guys, she's ready for the black paint, so I'm not going to film that because it's just applying paint and you'll see it when it's when I'll show you first layer the second layer so be back in a jiffy 
Okay guys, uh, one thing I noticed, I'm using these Fast Track, Fast Tracks paint. Is it Fast Tracks? Yes, Fast Tracks. Um, I'm noticing that there isn't all that much pressure in the can and it's throwing out these droplets which I'm not very fond of. So I put the can in some warm water to get a little bit more pressure in there. But we'll see how this ends up. Real fine layer, layer the first time. Apply thin layers each time, guys. Okay, that went better. There's more pressure in the can. But now you must be very uh, sure to clean it, dry the can because I had a few water droplets that fell on there. And yeah, you know, I think it will cover up when it's all evenly coated, but we'll see. Okay guys, we should be good with the black. I held it up against the light. <clears throat> there wasn't any light coming through anymore, so I think this is good. <clears throat> We're gonna take off the masks and apply some more masks for the orange. Okay, that turned out okay. I had a little bit of overspray, underspray, how do you call it, where it gotten under the tape. I got rid of that with some acetone, but you have to be very careful because it discolors the plastic. But I'm pleased. Let's go ahead with the orange. Okay. Now for the orange. And again, a light coat, start off with light coats. I'm building up from there. I'm not gonna show every coat, but just to be clear, work with thin coats, guys. And now the orange is done. I used the whole can on there. I found it very hard to get on the top of this edge here. In between the handlebars, what do you call them? The door grips. But now all we need to do is peel off the decals on the inside and give the, the last layer of white. And then it should all pop. Pretty pleased with the results of our Ah, I see some overspray here from the black. Ah, damn it. Well, can't have it all. Now to back it up with white, so everything pops a little bit more. And we get the decals in white. And then she's done. Then all we need to do is to apply the decals on the outside and see how she looks. All right. Okay guys, the white is under there. Covered it completely. Almost used the whole can, not all of it. But now it pops, it looks real good. I do want to back it up with black again because it just looks better looking when you look into the car is not much detail so black is better uh, but the can uh, is almost empty so I don't know I don't think I can completely cover it but I'm gonna give it an attempt and that's the last of the black on there I did not have enough to completely cover it all but still good enough now it's time to pull off the window masks 
and pull off the protective film on the outside and put down some graphics of yeah, the decals. These decals that come with the body. Okay, now for the protective film, and then we'll give you a better angle when we go uh, to apply the decals. I see a little bit of more of the overspray. That's a shame. Better luck next time. Still, look at that. Nice. It's not going to be like this for long. Let me give you guys a better angle for the decals. Okay, let's dress her up. I think that's about it. I think she's done, guys. For now. I'm still thinking about um, reinforcing the inside. I see everybody uh, use shoe goo and oh, uh, lots of people use shoe goo and drywall tape. Uh, I did not. Could not get my hands on shoe goo, so I tried drywall tape with silicone kit, but that kind of worked-ish. Um, so I was thinking about trying duct tape maybe for one time, but then you got the problem. It's only when you put it down like this, the strength is only in this way and not in that way. Maybe for the arcs or something, but. I wanted to hear from you guys. Let me know how you reinforce your bodies, if you reinforce your bodies. And maybe a tip for me. Um, still thinking about the duct tape, but we'll see what you guys come up with. Maybe there's something better in there. Let me know. Let me know in the comments, guys. Let me put this on the Santon and give you a quick montage and then uh, Call of the day in the next video we're gonna see it running but this video is long enough for now